So what are the supplements that you really need to lose fat and gain muscle? In this video, I'll be going over my favorite supplements that help me stay lean and strong year round. So let's go ahead and hit that intro. You ever walk into like a supplement store like GNC and then end up just being super overwhelmed? Like it makes me feel lost and confused just thinking about it. And the biggest thing is, it's just like, you're like, I have so many options. There's so many supplements out there. Which one should I choose? And I usually tell people, do this one thing. First off, figure out what do you wanna use that supplement for, and then two, make sure you're choosing a reputable brand for the supplements that you are choosing. Now the three supplements that I love are my multivitamins, my whey protein, and my pre-workout. In fact, let me get in. These guys, right here. So these are the multivitamins that I use. I usually try to get them with omega-3s as well. But the whole point is you just wanna make sure that at the end of the day, we don't always get all the nutrients and vitamins that we need throughout the day. And taking a multivitamin every single day is good to get those extra nutrients. Now I'm not saying it's gotta replace you know, whole foods, but it's just good to make sure that your bases are covered. So I usually do the chewable ones. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a big wimp and I can't swallow pills that well. So I usually get the chewable ones. I know, I'm like 12, 13 really. And the main brands that I use are Nature Made or Centrum. Those are the only two that I've really been using for like the last, I would say 12, 15 years. The second supplement I use is whey protein. Um, protein, not a lot of people get enough protein throughout the day and throughout the week. And protein is super important because it helps to rebuild your muscles after workouts, it helps you stay full, it helps to just kind of form the structures in your body. So protein is extremely important and sometimes you just don't get enough through the day with food. And that's why I like to supplement whey protein. I usually like to have it right after a workout and mix it with like oats and yogurt and just have a very powerful protein shake to make sure I'm getting enough protein in. I used to do mass gainer and to be honest, if you're trying to gain weight or gain muscle, I just wouldn't suggest to just eat more foods because of the fact that that mass gainer gives you some protein and then everything else is like just empty calories of like carbs, fats, and just a lot of stuff that I just don't think your body necessarily needs. And um, the main uh, company that I use is Optimum Nutrition. Their gold standard weight has been like literally my gold standard since forever, ever since I started taking whey protein. So very reliable company and a great brand. The last and final supplement that I use is pre-workout. Now, let me tell you that I don't think pre-workout is for everybody. The reason why I use pre-workout is because I usually work out in the afternoon after a long day at work and I commute forward and back and I'm just a little bit tired and I just don't lift as well. So I just need that little boost of energy. So pre-workout usually does it for me. Now the brand that I have right here is C4. I've also used Ghost. I've also used Jim Sapani's uh, pre-workout. All of them were pretty good. The only thing about pre-workouts is you do sometimes get used to it. So that's why I kind of switch brands sometimes between those three once I start getting adjusted to it. But again, it's not necessary. I will say caveat, sometimes when I take pre-workout, like my ears and toes tingle, it's like the weirdest feeling. And then also, Every time I've used pre-workout, I've had to go to the bathroom. Just keep that in mind before you do pre-workout. Um, but again, there's other type of pre-workouts that you can do is drink coffee, like black coffee, get yourself pumped up with good music. You don't necessarily have to take pre-workout. That's just what I like to use. Now, let me make sure I make this really clear. These supplements themselves are not gonna make you you know, lean, toned, all that. They just help. They are adding tools to your toolbox. So I always recommend to all of my clients, especially the ones in the Body Confidence Academy, that the main thing that you wanna do is make sure you're eating the right foods first. Eat whole foods and really focus on those first. Then go ahead and add the supplements because that's what they do, they supplement. They're not replacements, they are supplements. So they're supposed to supplement your holistic diet and that's what's gonna help you get lean, gain more muscle, lose more fat, and lose more weight. So just remember, supplements do not make you lose weight. They help you to live a better lifestyle and will help you lose fat 
over time with a whole holistic diet and a good workout plan. And if you do want to try a supplement, I say try some, like see if you could try it out first. Like maybe if a friend has it or you can go to a GNC and ask if you can have a sample first before you do it and see how it affects your body. See if it works for you, see if it doesn't, see if you like the taste, see if you don't like the taste, if it's pre-workout, see if it affects your body in a weird way and just do that, test it before you're committing 100% to it. So what supplements do you use? Are there any favorite brands that you like to go towards? Let me know in the comment box below. I hope this video was super helpful. If it was, go ahead and drop it a like, share with a friend, and I'll catch y'all next time. You already know, embrace the hype. Woo!